What is up guys, this is Zach from Anglers Escape and I'm about to leave Yellowstone Park. Behind me is Yellowstone Lake, but I did have some luck this week and I had three days with my family. I got 20 minutes here and there to do a little bit of fishing, but I had a lot of luck with this little Panther Martin inline spinner rainbow trout color, a four pound test line and my spinning rod, light action rod. I did have a couple of fish on my fly rod, both of which got off. The problem is, is you can't use barbs in Yellowstone Park. So when you're using those really small flies with that are barbless, it's really hard to keep them on the line. You can use treble hooks as long as they're barbless. You can't use baits. You can't use lead. You can't use plastic. So there's a lot of regulations. It's about 18 bucks for a three-day license, but I had a lot of fun. Caught three nice cutthroat trout, and I fished a ton of different spots. So I hope you enjoy these clips, and thanks for watching. got one guys I got him he just slammed that inline spinner oh this is a good fight he they really put up a good fight this might be a rainbow this time instead of a cutthroat I don't know but man he is going crazy there we go let's see what type of fish this is this is a cutthroat trout you can see by its little marks under its mouth let's get a beautiful release and let, watch this guy shoot off. Man, that guy has a lot of energy. He just rocketed off. Great catch. Oh, I got one, guys. That's a nice one. He hammered it. A lot of times when you're retrieving the lure, don't retrieve it at a steady speed. Every once in a while, pause it and just let it sit there and then start reeling again after that little, like, half a second pause. But it's another beautiful cutthroat trout. Four pound test line. You gotta get him in the back end as soon as possible. But uh, you can see he's a cutthroat because he's got that red right there. Nailed that Panther Martin rainbow trout color inline spinner. I took off the barbs or pinched him down. Let's go ahead and get a great release on this beautiful, beautiful fish. And he shoots off. I got one guys in Yellowstone Park. Beautiful fish. It's a nice sized one. Actually, it might be a cutthroat trout. See that red right there? That actually means it's a cutthroat. Got it on a little Panther Martin spinner. I'm gonna try to get him back ASAP because these are uh, a native fish species. So let me get him back in the water. And release this beautiful cutthroat trout. You can see the red under his gills. And there he goes. He's oh, there we go, guys. We got one. Let's see if we can't keep him on. Nice little fish. Get him over here into the shallows. Try not to let him off. There's another one. This might be a baby brown trout. See, I got him with that Panther Martin inline spinner. The Grand Teton Mountains is right there. And right now I'm fishing on the Snake River, but that's a beautiful little fish. I don't see the red markings, maybe because it's a baby, but it's fins, I can't tell if it's a brook trout, a brown trout or a rainbow trout or a cutthroat trout. So just let me know in the comment section. A beautiful fish. These are all new fish species that I've been catching. I've never caught these types of trout before. So it's a lot of fun. And with the Grand Teton Mountains in the background, it's just beautiful on the Snake River. And uh, let's go ahead and get this guy in the water. All right, let's do a real quick release of this trout. And there he goes, shot off. Oh, I got one, guys. It's a small one, but it's a fish. A little baby trout. Beautiful little guy. There he goes, popped off. Oh, I got one, I got one, I got one. There we go, we got a trout, guys. He's a small guy, but it's still fun on this four pound test line, real small spinner, a real small cutthroat. And there he goes, shoots off. 
All right, guys, real quick, I want to show you this lure I'm using. I'm seeing a lot of people fly fishing, and I've seen no one catch anything, and there's about five or six guys fly fishing out here the past hour, and I've caught about four trout on this little lure. It's just a Panther Martin size one rainbow trout color. It's really hard to go wrong with an inline spinner. I'm using four pound test line for trout. I wouldn't use anything bigger than a light action rod. I was trying my fly rod and I got a couple, they kind of came up to the fly and last second they turned away. But these inline spinners are really hard to beat. I'm definitely out fishing the other people here. Granted, I'm not catching monster trout, but they're also going for these small ones in this little stream off the Snake River. Here's a bison crossing. Look at that, wow. Here we are on the very peak of Avalanche Mountain. Amazing 360 views. Just made it to the top. It's pretty incredible up here. Guys, I don't know if you guys can see this, but there's hundreds of thousands of mosquitoes. I'm getting eaten alive. I forgot the bug spray. And it's dusk out here in northwestern Wyoming in Yellowstone. Inside Yellowstone, here's our foil dinner. Beef, potatoes, a bunch of mixed vegetables cooked on the campfire.